So, welcome to my crib. This is my hotel room in London, and I uh, just wanted to demonstrate what we have. And I remember looking online before I checked this hotel, and uh, you know, there were a lot of ratings that said that, uh, oh, this hotel is really grungy, and they're really overdue for some renovations, and it's just terrible. I'd never go back there. A lot of other people saying, well, you know, it's just, it's got some certain qualities, but you're paying for the location. But, you know, I have to confess, you know, this is a different sort of hotel than what I'm used to in your American best westerns and whatnot. This hotel room comes with something called Corby at Your Service. And it's actually an electric trouser presser. No, it's not like an iron. There's no ironing board or anything, but what you do is you pull on this lever and this thing swings out and you put your pants inside or at least the pant legs and then you put it in there and then you put it on a timer and it presses your pants for you now you can't do shirts and you can't do you know jackets or anything like that but your your pants will look wonderful nook what's in here empty shelves what's in here Oh, suitcases and things. Oh, okay, now. You don't need to see my dirty clothes here. Breakfast nook. Something here called a shoe sponge. Ooh, spongy. All right. But anyway, we have a wonderful view. We have a fan and a TV. Luxurious accommodations. And I do get free wireless, so um, they have that over the... Uh, Hilton any day, but you know, you might notice that this uh, window frame has uh, seen better days and uh, you know, that's how I'd like to see my London with a little bit of uh, crumblingness to it, just like the British Empire. Anyway, so what do we have across the street? Some building that looks like, mm, can't tell, maybe that's a school some kind of prison facility. Yeah, it's a nice place. Here in the bathroom we have light switch on the outside. Oh boy! Another crumbling window, but this one you can't open. Looks like at one time you might have been able to do that, but maybe somebody jumped. And so that's no longer an option. We have a very exuberant toilet bidet, which I have to confess I've still never quite figured out um, what to do with, you know, I, technically I know the theory, but <laughs> okay, anyway, non-heating towel holder, bathtub, nice big bathtub with a shower nozzle and jacuzzi features that appear to be purely decorative. I did take a bath earlier and it was a nice bath, but no jacuzzi, no shower function, but that's okay. Anyway, that is my wonderful, wonderful hotel room.